What about the exam system? I mean, how do we get around that? I mean, uh, well, I think you could um, should uh, you could do things. Like it, it, making progress with the exam system really, really difficult because the awarding bodies play such a big part, mm. and it's in their interest to see yeah progress progress in yeah. the sense of uh, school and achievement. It's a, it's a global, you know, something like it's a global, global, right. a global right. yeah, yeah, organization. Yeah. Um, yeah. But I, you know, you could do things. You could say, well, we'll only release the syllabus. Mm. for GCSE with 50 days to go. Right. So wouldn't you have to teach chemistry really well so that with 50 days to go you can rehearse the mm. syllabus? Because yeah. you couldn't start from fresh. Yeah. Uh, you could say, here are 200 questions that might be on the examination. You've got two years to learn as many of them as you like. Yeah. And we'll generate the questions on the day, computer-wise, mm. like the National Lottery spins yeah. around and you get five, five questions. Yeah. And I, I think you've got to keep the breadth for as long as possible and narrow mm. down the, sort of, uh, the opportunity to uh, come to the peak for the exam. Uh, that, no yeah. problem with exams in yeah. the sense that, well, they're a bit archaic, but um, you could say to youngsters that you've got to come to the peak, mm. but not from three years back. Yeah. Um, yeah. You know, Jessica Ennis only changed four years for each yeah, Olympics, yeah, yeah, and we're yeah. training kids now for years on end to be able to do a two-hour exam. Yeah. Um, bite-sized learning, repetition learning, mm -hmm. only learning the bits that matter. Don't yeah. read the whole of the crucible, just read these pages. Yeah, yeah. You don't need to know what happens, just get it there. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think uh, the exams are stuck in the, uh, in the time warp when but 15% of children took exams. And now 100% of children take exams. We're still using the same technology, the same methodology, mm -hmm. the same approach. And maybe we need radical thinking. And, and since we've got all these politicians who say they're radical, mm. it'd be really good if they did something. But I mean, go, what do you think of GOAT solutions? You, to go back to like more do or die exams, terminal exams, paper exams. I mean, clearly not something you feel would work. No. Well, 40 years ago, 15% of children took O level, yeah. equivalent to GCSE, C grade. No, 100% do. It was supposed to be an exam for all. Yeah. And now all are taking it. We seem not to be happy that they're all taking it and mm. doing well, which was the aim of the examination. So it achieved its aim. Mm. So instead of simply criticising the exam, we might look again at what's the purpose of education and schooling. And yeah. what Michael Gove seems to want to do is, you know, to take them back to the days when we had syrup of and Epsom salts and life, life would be very good again. Yeah. Um, just now and again in your life, you have to go in a room and sit a metre away from anybody else and write for three hours without speaking, but yeah, not very often. Mm. And it seems a very strange thing that you sort of... Mm. Uh, what do we say in that you can predict... I can predict your potential based on three hours of spilling out everything that you know about yeah. a subject that you've learned yeah. in order to come in. So we're picking out the people who can learn and write for three hours. Mm. That's Old sort of person it's that not. It's there. not a valid assessment. So it, the validity, as it were, in the sort right. of technical so, term, you know, is not not we, there, yeah, and they're yeah, often not reliably yeah. marked either, are they? And couldn't we? Well, the, mark, yeah. the reliability of the marking is questionable, as we yeah. know. Yeah. The, um, the helping children to frame an answer so that they practice the frame over and over again. Yeah. Um, some of which you'd say is applicable to later life, but mm. a lot of it isn't, and. Um, I think the real challenge is to say, well, how do we project... Are we trying to show in an examination that they applied themselves through the course mm. and stuck with it and yeah. showed persistence and mm. <laughs> sort of had the character not to give up? Yeah. Or are we saying that this examination shows your future potential? It seems to me that by default, if you survive, it lets you into the next mm. doorway. Yeah. And we, we do fill children with a load of fibs, really. You yeah. know, the idea that the grades matter that much. I mean, yeah. once you've got a C or a book, yeah. nobody asks you anymore.